Miss Gina, what you doing? over the edge of our tiles, uh, for the edge of our bench. And I'm starting that process by making uh, ribs that will dry more quickly and that are shaped to be strong enough to fold over the edge uh, and not crack when there's pressure on them. I'm kind of experimenting, but my thinking is that if uh, these little ribs that dry first are strong enough when I roll them, to hang off my hand without cracking, that they'll be strong enough to stay in that shape that's going to take a lot of pressure. Uh, so I'll first build up the ribs. We're working with kind of wet cob on a tight time frame. Let those dry as I'm going and then pretend these are more dry. I'll come back and work cob in between them create my finish lip that ideally is stronger than just trying to stack this kind of mushy cob on top of each other and hope that it stays on the edge. Yep, yeah, that's about it for now. And it's going to help hold these panels on the front, these lovely ceramic tiles. Uh -huh. That's going to give us a nice little edge to our bench which is kind of boxy right now okay. so that's cool yeah. yeah thank you you're welcome Hi.